And here we go. That is our Dinopithecus. Can I ride it? Oh, I can't. Where? It, it's wedged. Hey guys, before we get into the video today, I just want to say first off, thank you so much for clicking on the video, and that we're also on the road to 1,000 subscribers. So, if you guys are new here or have been around for a while and just aren't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing and joining the Discord, as it is the best way to support my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Alrighty guys, welcome back to Lost Island. Today we're going to be taming up our final creature. As you can see here, I got my three Amogsaurus here behind me. And me and Dez are already ready to go. These guys are lovely. They look beautiful. I can't wait to have them until... What, I already know what colors I want on the back. I want to try and keep the... I want to try and keep the red. And I don't know about these other ones. It looks like there's a couple colors in there. Um, but I'll figure it out, but I already got Dez packed. We're ready to go tame up some Dinopithecus. Alrighty guys, so I have... <clears throat> Three, two, one. Alrighty guys, so I have found the 150 I want. She is down in there. I just need to go find her now. Well, technically, I gotta get the trap built. Just, I need to find out where to build the trap. Because they're all down in there. Like the monkeys are down in the trees. Alright, it's like the Viet Cong. Okay, so I think we're going to just set it up in the river. That's an acro. In the river. Where I just said we're going to set it up. God damn it. <laughs> the river's very popular today. Please don't be a high level. Please don't be a high level. Please don't be a high level. You're not a high level, but you're also giving me blood. Oh, this guy's got to be like a level 75 or something. What is that monkey? Level 15. Acro is down. There's a lot of brackies in the area. So, I feel like actually right, this river slopes right here, right here. You see right here? Perfect spot. So, I'm going to just set it up. So, the way this works is we're going to need 10 foundations. Okay, it's much better to land and do this, but still stay on your bird. So, there's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Your bird, or your mount does attack. Ten. Alright. That's all you need to place. Next up, you're going to start taking your double door frames. Alright, you're going to place these all around. Another cinema crops just starved to death on my back. We do got monkey nearby. Which got me a little on edge. Okay, for as of right now, they have not spotted me. So we will continue with our efforts here. So, that right there will contain one monkey. So, this trap is designed to contain as many monkeys as you want, technically. But I'm building mine. Oh my god, I hit a troodon. <laughs> Where are you at? Dun, 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 dun. Oh, where'd it go? I'm gonna just eat this guy, then I'll get my trap built. Monkeys got way too close to me. I think they're actually the 150s I need, or the 150 I need is in that group. I'm going to fly up here, lose their aggro. I'm not done with the trap, though. All right, I forgot. I'm on a Desmodus. We got stealth mode, okay? Woo! I, I just realized as soon as we hit, we go out of stealth mode. It's like, it's like what happened? I'm just staring like, uh... Looks like the monkeys have gone. Please clear out. I need to finish this. Oh, okay. I can't hold as many monkeys as I want right now. Is 
There's a lot of monkeys. A lot. Okay. I was having so much trouble getting those. I mean, it was like trying to find the predator, looking for the shimmer. But it's almost night. Um, so what what is next is we need a place. I forgot they're in Des they're in Des's inventory. They're heavy, so these are gonna get placed like that all the way around, so that way they work like ramps to drive monkeys into the trap. Okay. Also, if you guys are wondering, the Amargosaurus trap from last episode in this one are not mine. I'm sorry. I forgot to give the guy a shout out last video. Um, there will be a link to his channel in the description of that video, though. I forgot to say in the video. Um, but the, these are traps by Fat Dog. Um, Captain Fat Dog, I believe, is the name. Uh, probably he'll have an overlay with his channel and all that. But, yeah. They're Captain Fat Dog's traps. Um, they're not my own personal ones. My own personal ones kind of suck for this. I would not have ever thought about this. I mean, really. I hear a monkey. Oh, that's Gally. It was like, I hear a monkey. But it was not a monkey. Can I please place that pillar? Not pillar, a ramp. Triangle. Yeah, it's a triangle roof. But we're going to be using them as ramps. Okay. Like, see what I mean? Like, it's hard to see it because I don't got the green on the bat. Hey, so I got my trap done. Now all I need to do is wait until morning to lead out the Dinopithecus. Okay, guys. Here is the troop of monkeys that I need. So, where's that one? 50. There she is. 29 in health. That's what we're after. So, it's just getting them up to the trap. That's the thing. So, I, I, I'll start it off easy. I mean, we'll get close. Got them all. Stick close to the ground. I want, I want, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Is that the alpha after me? As long as I have the alpha, we should be good. See, the way this trap works is if this guy can't get around, eventually I want to see what I got in the trap. What do I have in the trap? I got a 35 and a level 10. Damn, not what I need. You. What are you? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh! Monkeys, come on. Come on, come this way. You're level 15. I don't need you. But if I can get you in the trap, that means I don't have to worry about you. Nice. What's this one? You're the 150. Okay. It, again, if I can get them in the trap, I don't have to worry about them. But it just means more betas I have to kill. Honestly. And voila. Um, let me double check. Make sure there's no monkeys. I did spend some time getting stuff for blood packs. Okay. No monkeys. Now, what we need to do is kill all the ones except the beta. Or the alpha. We need to kill all the betas. So, that's what we brought. Good old trusty. I'll execute you all. Gotta reload. There's an egg down there. I don't want to risk it because it's probably a Bronto egg. I don't recognize the color. There we go. So now, if I hop off, it's going to say something like 80%. Or it needs to be 80%. Oh, yeah. There. Oh, it was only one feed with exceptional? Okay. Um, These are actually going to be pretty easy tames. So, I really don't know. We might have another 13-minute video episode. Because all I really want to do these episodes is tame these guys. Um, I'm just trying to postpone fighting the dragon as much as I can. We got... tech. I'm thinking 
We got five months. Everyone's saying four. I'm, everyone's thinking it's going to come out the first of the month. Arc Ascended. I think it might come out later. But I never. I might be wrong. But I'm kind of... I am changing my plans. We are going to get some creatures. Um, I am doing Explorer Notes off camera. They are extremely easy. That's why. Okay. Um, there was like a bunch of monkeys around last time. Where'd they all go? Where'd all that shit go? They're probably all like off fighting something like an acro or something off in the woods because they've killed basically everything. Okay, I just got my sanguine elixir off of Dez here. I'm gonna cryo him up and I'm actually gonna go hide inside the trap just in case we actually have anything attack us, you know? This actually might be the safest place to be, is in the trap. Because this is technically where I could tame him. I could probably raise this up a bit. And, you know. But this is the way he has, uh... What is it? Captain Fat Dog. This is Cat... Yeah, this, this trap was made by Captain Fat Dog. I will have a link to his channel in the description. He's also a lot... A bigger channel than mine. So, uh... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You guys probably already know of him. So. And here we go. That is our Dinopithecus. Can I ride it? Oh, I can't. Where? It, it's wedged. I gotta get it cryoed. Oh, I shoot. Dinopithecus has been changed by Arc Life. This species is definitely larger than any um, I, I will get back to that. I'm gonna get this guy like cryoed up and then we'll hop on his back and I'll play it. I didn't even use the Sanguine Elixir. I realized that. I just noticed that. Um, but anyways, we'll go into here and we will go play the Dossy Air if I can find it. Lead Dinopithecus has been changed by Arc Life. This species is definitely larger than any I remember from the fossil record, and these oversized baboons show a more pack-oriented behavior than I would have expected in their kind. Whole troops will organize around an alpha. And fall apart if that Dinopithecae are opportunistic and will eat just about anything. They're also excellent climbers. I've seen them scramble up sheer cliff faces and leap between trees to scavenge food for their troop. Dinopithecae will bear sharp teeth and toss well aimed handfuls of their own excrement when provoked. Their feces is what really sets this species apart. They've managed to weaponize a parasite in it that disables tech. I feel like that parasite deserves its own dossier. If you can manage to tame enough Dinopithecae, you'll soon find yourself with a small troop at your disposal. Your mini troop will organize around the strongest of your tames, their new alpha, that can then direct them at a target with a shrieked battle cry. No need to saddle your tamed Dinopithecus to ride it. It will make one for you using its own tail. Just hold on tight and it will take you straight up walls and across zip lines. In battle, your Dinopithecus will fling fecal projectiles, grenades, or a combination that I like to call EBM for Explosive Bowel Movement. Alrighty guys, I think that's going to probably do it for this episode, so I will see you guys in the next one. And we'll probably be back on the island getting some artifacts. <laughs>